Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of Tips and Tricks, brought to you by Teaching and Learning Services here at the University of St. Francis. In today's episode, we're going to talk about a brand new feature in Canvas called Submit for Student. Now imagine if you have a couple of students in your classes, and one of them claims last night they were trying to submit their assignment, whatever it is, and they had some sort of an issue. It wouldn't submit, had some other glitch, maybe it was user error, not sure. Another one claims, well, I just didn't submit it in time after the deadline. I still want to accept both of those assignments, but I don't want them to be sitting over in my email. That's where they sent them last night, just to know that I could have them, just to know they were actually done. I don't want them in my email for very long in case I accidentally lose them, I delete them, or they get buried in a pile of a uh, thousand other emails in there in the past. So I want everything to be stored in Canvas. So how do I do that? I'm going to take their assignment and put it in the Canvas. Here's how you do it. So I'm going to go into my grade book here. i got three students in here, all exemplary students for that matter. Let's go into example one, and it says Eric and Petty. Let's click on that box underneath there. Right next to it is this little square with an arrow. Now notice underneath the name it says Submit for Student. Let's go ahead and click on that. This next box comes up. It says Drag a File or Choose a File to Upload. I'm going to go ahead and click into that box as well. Here's the assignment that I found. It says Chapter 17, The Big Fight. Go ahead and click on that. Now notice it says up here as you scroll up a little bit, it'll say File Name. Here's the file I chose. Here's a check mark next to it that confirms it's been uploaded. Now if this was wrong, you can go ahead and trash it from here. So I'm going to go down a little bit to the bottom right-hand corner, and let's say Submit. It'll give me a big old check mark that says, Been Done. So if you notice, you go back to that example one, the assignment. There is now this little icon that says there's something for me to grade. Okay, that's great. But I want to show you something interesting about this. Let's go back into the assignment itself, example one. Let's click Edit. If I scroll down a little bit, notice the submission type. This says online. In order to do this function in Canvas, this has to be set to online. Now watch what happens if I take that away, if I say no submission at all. I set this up for some reason with no submission. Maybe it's a paper submission somewhere. Let's go ahead and save here. and I'm going to go back to my grades again. Go back to that example one. And if I click into Joe Smith, into the rectangle box beneath that, and I go to that square with the arrow again, and I click on it. Notice the Submit for Student is no longer available. So you have to have the ability to submit something. I guess that's what I'm trying to tell you. I hope this was helpful. Have a good day, folks.